Good morning, good morning, good morning from Minneapolis, Minnesota. This is Coach Lance Leo welcoming you to workout live session number five, workout 1032, I believe. All right, friends, real quick intro before we get started. I'll allow some of you all to kind of jump into this workout. When you do jump into the workout, please let me know where you're coming from, where you're watching from. I uh, would love to know where you are doing that. In this specific workout, in this specific workout, we are going to do a whole lot of jumping, a lot of jumping, utilizing the jump rope to keep those fast twitch muscle fibers firing and to keep you feeling strong and young. We'll also incorporate the kettlebell foundational movements, uh, the kettlebell deadlift, the kettlebell swing, the clean, I actually take the deadlift out, my bad. We'll be doing the swing, the clean, and the snatch. All right, so we'll be working through those. Uh, it is important to know, let me pull in the actual details. And I should probably slow down a, a, a little bit here so some of you guys can come on into this workout. But the primary goal today, guys, is it's going to keep you strong. It's going to give you a stimulus. It's going to keep you, keep you young, keep you fast on your feet. You will probably want to grab some water. I don't know about you, where you're joining me from, but it is going to be hot. You're going to probably lose some poundage. And it's, not, it's probably going to be a lot of water weight. So the key is to stay hydrated. All right, so let's do this. Let's move into the actual details of the workout. Uh, let's open this next slide. This will be the first 12 minutes of the workout. We'll go through a three minute warm up as we always do to get that blood pump going. Uh, and then we'll essentially move into the following. You'll see we're gonna work on 15 seconds of jumping We'll then be doing 15 seconds of swinging using the right arm with a 30 second rest. We'll then move into 15 seconds again of jumping rope. We'll then be doing a swing with the left arm again with a 30 second rest. We'll then move into a clean of 15 seconds. Again, same amount of rest. We'll then go clean on the opposite arm. And then lastly, we'll move through the snatch and then the snatch. Again, utilizing that 15 seconds on, 15 seconds off, with then a 30 seconds rest. We'll then take a mandatory one minute rest after that 12 minute block. Next, next focal point will then be, be to actually increase that load a bit. You'll notice that we're gonna go 20 seconds. We're gonna go 20 seconds of the jump rope. What up, Luker? 20 seconds of the jump rope, 20 seconds of the swing, 20 seconds of the rest. Again, that's gonna be a 12 minute. That's gonna be a 12 minute block. We'll go through that two times. In that last 12 minute block, this is what we'll be focusing on. It'll get a little more challenging. We'll be doing a 25 second jump rope, 25 second swing with a, only a 10 second rest. So it's very important, pick that bell wisely uh, because that load and fatigue could start to set in as we move into that third block. For what it's worth, I even calculated what the total amount of work will be done. Essentially it's gonna be 24 minutes of total work with 12 minutes of rest total, not including the mandatory one minute rest after each 12 minute block. Hopefully all this makes sense. We'll now talk quickly about the scaling option. St scaling option one would be to stick to one work rest ratio from the very beginning. It might be that you're new in this fitness journey. I would suggest that you do 15 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest with a 30 second recovery, literally from the beginning to the end. Uh, option two for scaling would be just not to jump rope, right? Don't jump rope at all. Use that time as just rest. That's completely up to you, even though I'm a huge, huge fan of the jump rope. You'll so see that I did say don't jump rope on the even minutes or don't jump rope at all. All right, option three. Option three would be just to sit out for one minute at any time. So use your own discretion for that as well. All right. Super excited to have you. I will say, last but not least, I do have a little giveaway at the very end of this session, so you're going to want to stay to hang around for that giveaway. All right, friends, I am ready to rock. I am super excited to hit this one. Again, this is going to be a good one, the Kettlebell Jump Rope Challenge 1.0. All right, so let's get this party started. We're going to do a three-minute warm-up. As you can see there, we're gonna do a squat jump, we're gonna do a lateral skate, and then a jump rope, each one of those 30 seconds each. 
it's going to get hot in here. It's going to get hot in here. So make sure, make sure you're hydrated and not usually, but it'd probably be a good idea to see where you're at in terms of your, your actual body weight pre and post. That'll help you kind of refine your hydration needs. All right, friends, so we'll be doing a 30 second squat jump. We'll do a lateral skate and we'll do 30 seconds of jumping rope in 20 seconds. Taking off in 15 seconds. This will be an easy three minute warm up. If you have any questions, good morning, Jeff Tinder. Welcome, welcome. Let me know where you're, you're checking in from. Here we go, 30 seconds, squat jumps. We're gonna do a 30 second squat jump. Light on your feet, use those arms as needed. Okay, in five seconds, lateral skate jump. Okay, so now we're just moving left to right, making that lateral hip respond. Glute medius. Again, 30 seconds. Try not to let that other foot touch. All right, so we're just trying to keep all that load on one leg. All right, jump rope, 30 seconds. We're doing a lot of this today, it's good. Try to keep those elbows in. Try to keep those hands steady. We're not trying to go up and down with those hands. Again, stay light on your feet. Wonderful. Two rounds, here we go. Get light on your feet. You should hardly hear yourself landing. Again, lateral skating, left to right. Once again, try to be light on your feet. If you're new to this, perfectly fine to have that back leg as a trailer for added stability. Okay, 15 seconds. Outstanding, last 30 seconds. Fast twitch muscle fibers are what we're attacking today. They are quick to be gone as we age. So we need to keep them firing, friends. We'll do a lot of that today. Three. Two and rest. All right, wonderful. Feels good to move, friends. All right, if at this point in time anyone has any questions, please throw them up there. Fantastic from Brampton, Canada. Love it. Welcome, my friend. Welcome. All right, guys, so if you're new to the channel, my primary goal is to provide a training stimulus that helps you feel strong and young and turn back that chronological age, or chronological age that it might be at. All right, friends, here we go. We're gonna focus in now. Uh, we'll take off in a moment. I just wanna make sure if you're new, just coming in. We're gonna be focusing now on a 15 second, 15 second jump rope, 15 second swing on the right arm, 30 seconds rest. And as you can see, that challenge will get more and more as we go, okay? All right. All right, guys, here we go. Let's have fun. Get a clean slate, start off from the top. All 
All right, taking off in 30 seconds. Again, stop, try to stay hydrated. This one will actually, you'll probably lose upwards of five pounds just in water weight. Taking off here approximately in 20 seconds. 15 seconds of jump rope. We'll then go 15 seconds with the left arm with the swing. Then 30 seconds rest. I'll do my best to stay on point and on pace here. Here we go, three, two, one. 15 seconds, here we go. You can do whatever you like with the jump rope. You can keep it simple. You can do some running, high knees, up to you, whatever you'd like to do. Keep it simple. There's going to be a lot of this today. 15 seconds. All right, right to the one arm swing. Great job. Right arm is done. I really hope this is all making sense. If you have any questions as we go, just let me know. The challenge will increase as we get deeper into this workout. Taking off in three, two, and here we go. Okay, left, I'm sorry, left hand. Here we go. Great job. For what it's worth, I'm using a 53 or 24 kil kilogram bell. Again, I know this load will get real the deeper we go into this workout. I'm hitting approximately six to seven reps in these 15 seconds. You find you, you find your rhythm. That could be four reps, could be three reps, could be five reps. Here we go. Back to the rope. All right, friends, we're doing a right arm clean. Right arm clean, I'm gonna start right underneath my body. Find those glutes. Great job. Now keep in mind, using that start stop methodology, you're not gonna match the same rep count as you will with the swing. All right, friends, coming up now on the, we're going to be doing a left arm clean. There is a little bit of transition between rope to strength. Here we go. 15 seconds. Go get it. Here we go. Feel free to manipulate how you're jumping to make it easier or harder. All right, friends, here we go. Left arm. Fast hips, fast hands. Good work. Coming up next, snatch. Coming up next will be the kettlebell snatch. I will be starting that bell underneath me versus out in front. But again, if you feel you need momentum, by all means use that momentum by bringing that bell out in front. Here we go, take it off in less than 10. Keeping that body moving, here we go, ready, go. Perfect, right arm snatch.
Wonderful. Again, a lot of this is sweat management as well. <laughs> Keep those hands dry. Can't wait to get back to that rope. Again, 15 seconds on the rope. 10 seconds. If at any time you have questions, please let me know. Five seconds, taking off. Here we go. Three, two, let's go get it. Feel free to increase pace if you feel like you got that energy to do so. Okay, left hand and snatch. Start behind your right. Right at your arches. Good work, friends. All right, our one minute rest will follow after this six minute block. A little bit of wash, rinse, and repeat. Same thing. Same mindset of 15 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest. Here we go. Three, two, and let's go. Okay, swing left hand. I'm sorry, right arm, here we go. Great job. Stay with me, friends. Stay with me. We're now moving to that left arm swing in 12 seconds. Ready, go. Gadget, gadget there, here we go. Left hand swing. Good work, good work. Okay, moving into the clean, again, 15 seconds. Right hand. Ready, and go. Right hand. Beautiful. Curious, if you have time, let me know how many reps you are getting. Right on, Corey. Love it. Well, welcome. Welcome. Corey, I hope you enjoy this one. All right, back to that rope, back to that rope in about 12 seconds. You just crush that right arm. Coming up to the left, one arm clean. Here we go. Left. Clean, bring it up underneath you. Fast hands, fast hips. Beautiful, good work. 
Okay, last two minutes. Then we have ourselves a one minute clean or one minute rest. Up next will be the kettlebell snatch with the right hand. Okay, three, two, and let's go. Beautiful. Okay, left, I'm oh, sorry, right arm snatch. Here we go. Wonderful. Of the three, I believe the snatch is the most challenging to master. It takes a lifetime to master that one. All right, 10 seconds, 15 seconds of jump. Then we finish this block with the snatch of 15 seconds. Here we go, three, two, and let's move. <clears throat> right on, left-handed snatch, keep it close. Wonderful. Great job. All right, one minute rest. One minute rest. Time to recalibrate. It's going to come out to be only 30 seconds rest. Hopefully that's adequate for you guys. We're only going to go 30 seconds. Same kettlebell size. But now, friends, we're moving to... 30 seconds, I'm sorry, 20 seconds. So we're now moving 20 seconds now. All right, 20 seconds of jump, 20 seconds of jump, and the rest is all strength at the same work interval. Ready, and let's go. Here we go, 20 seconds. Increasing volume ever so slightly. seconds. Okay, here we go. Right arm swing. 20 seconds. Great job. 20 seconds of rest. Okay, here we go. Jumping, 20 seconds. They left-handed swing in approximately five seconds. 20 seconds of swing with the left hand. Coming up on the clean in this next block. Again, try to stay on top of those that grip of yours. I'm already feeling challenged. Here we go. Okay. 
Get right in and clean, right hand clean. Here we go, get it up underneath you. Fast hands, fast hips. Clean coming up. All right, here we go. Twenty seconds. Jump. Get left-handed clean. Let's go. Beautiful. How about you guys? Are you dealing okay with the grip? How are we holding up? Snatch is now coming up on us with the right hand first. 20 seconds of jumps. Let's roll. Here we go. Come on. Wonderful. 20 seconds. Right handed snatch. Left hit a snap for 20 seconds coming up. Appreciate the thumbs up. Whoops, here we go. Let's roll. Let's roll 20 seconds off a bit. Sorry about that. In five seconds, back to the snatch, left hand. Left hand snatch, go get some. Keep that bell close. Great job. Six more minutes at the 20, 20, and 20. Taking off in five. 20 seconds, let's roll. Right handed clean or swing. Ready? Let's go. Stay with me. Come on. Stay with me. Taking off in three, 20 seconds. Let's go. Feels good to be alive, friend. It's good to be alive. 10 seconds. Let's 
set. Here we go, left swing. Four minutes left. Four minutes left, then we have a one minute rest. That's a 30 second rest. Up next is the clean. 20 seconds. Outstanding. Right hand and clean, 20 seconds. We go 20 seconds of jumping, ready? Let's get it. <sighs> 10 seconds, clean on the left side, and five seconds. Okay, left handed clean, five, sorry, 20 seconds, here we go. Coming up, friends, 20 seconds of snatches, 20 seconds of snatches in five seconds. Here we go. Time is flying now. Here we go. Snatch with the right arm first. Whoops. Again, keep that bell close. Wonderful. If you are feeling fatigue, if there's a place that you pause, Pause at the top. Or maybe I'm the only one that's feeling a little bit tired. Good tired. Five seconds, 20 seconds of jump. jump. Three, two, here we go. There's a difference between slow jump rope tempo and fast tempo. Know the difference between the two. Know that you can move with precision. Fast or slow. Wonderful. Left handed snatch. Outstanding. Moving into the 25 25. Moving into the 25 25. Here we go. We're going to do 25 seconds, 25 and 10 seconds. It's going to get, going to get interesting now, friends. It's going to get interesting now. Whoops. Sorry about that. Maybe we all need a little more time. 
Anybody give me some feedback if you can. Let me know how you're feeling. Again, friends, we're now going into a 25 of work, 25 of rest. I'm sorry, 25 of jumping, 25 of work. And then we're resting for 10 seconds. This one is not going to allow for a lot of conversation. We're just going to have to kind of lean into this. So get ready to work. Come on, here it is. Give me 25 seconds of movement. Jumping, that's with a rope or without a rope. And again, we're training those fast twitch muscle fibers that are quick to go as we age. It's unavoidable, but this is how we keep them alive, baby. Here we go. Five seconds. We're going swings. Right on. Here we go. Great job. I counted out 12. Jump in. All joking aside, by all means, if you don't have a jump rope, you can do simply the same movement without a rope. It just does not recruit that upper body as a jump rope. Okay, left-handed swing. Dry off your hand so the bell does not go flying. Again, guys, try to dry off those hands. Kind of important. I've already thrown my 62 last week. Here we go. Coming up next, right-handed clean, 25 seconds. Here we go. Right arm clean. <sighs> Wonderful. Great work, guys. And girls, back to the rope, 25, let's get it. <sighs> Left handed clean. Here we go. Slippery Bells is right. Not much time here. I'm off by a bit, but here we go. Stay on task. Snatch. Coming up. Right hand. Give yourself time to transition. Here we go.
Who's working out there? Holy mackerel. Right? Damn. Time goes fast when you don't want it to. You notice that? The goal is keep moving. The goal is to keep moving. Know that any time, hopefully this is loud and clear, you can rest. You can also modify the work-rest ratio. All right, if I'm right, I think we're on to our snatch. Ugh, brain is getting foggy. I'm off. All right, left arm, I believe. Skip something, guys. I think I skipped something. Great brain here. Off by 10 seconds. It's perfectly fine. You just keep working. I think I forgot the clean. I think I forgot the clean. All right, guys, I'm doing the clean on the left side. I think I missed it. Here we go. Lock out the glutes. Man. All right, guys, I think I messed that one up, but we're going to come up, hit that swing. I'm sorry, hit the, the jump. Start from the top. Swing, guys, last six minutes. Sorry for the brain fog. Couldn't tell you my address to my home right now. All right, 25 seconds of work. We're going to 25 seconds of the swing on the right arm. Here we go. Take your time, make it work. <laughs> oh. Oh, sorry for the brain fog, absolute brain fog. Okay, next up is the left swing, working through 25 of jumps. Here we go. On a one to 10 scale, 10 being all out exertion, this is that 8.5 day, okay? So I pick, or pick this one wisely, going left hand swing. Let's go get it, come on. Don't let go of the bell, I've done it before. Don't want to do it live. Here we go. Five seconds coming up into the clean with the right arm. Okay, right arm clean. 25 seconds. Let's go get it. Fast hips, fast hands. Keep it close. Good posture at the top. Beautiful.
Left handed clean coming up. Towels cannot get my hands dry enough. Here we go. Home stretch, friends. Home stretch. Stay with me. Would love to know how many of you made it through. I'm feeling 155, check out 165. Respiratory drive control. Left handed clean. Let's get this. Again, keep it under you. Elbow comes in quick. Bell follows. Last five seconds. Bam. Unbelievable. Last two minutes. Right handed snatch coming up. Sorry, friends. Oh, here we go. Sweat everywhere. Okay, snatch right hand, coming up in five seconds. Let's go. No chance of drying this thing off. Good. If you do that right, there should be no chance of a projectile. Here we go, last hurrah. Twenty-five jump, twenty-five snatch. Then we break tape. Then we chillax. Give me five seconds. Left handed snatch. Let's finish and finish well. Here we go. Maximally contract glutes at the top. Absolutely fantastic. You have got to be kidding me. No doubt. Got to be kidding me. Oh well, it's life. It's looking forward to sharing that one. All right, friends, that was exceptional. I hope you found a good test from that effort. Again, we essentially worked for 24 minutes. We rested for a total of 12 minutes. That does not include the warm up. That does not include the warm up. All right, I don't want to keep you around too long. If, if you have any questions, I would absolutely love to hear from you. Those of you who are around to hear it, I did say I was going to offer something to everyone that is still on. This is open to someone who's in Canada, Italy, or right here in Minneapolis. The first person to send me an email at, hold up. Here we go. Bear with me, guys. First person to send me an email at coachlancemn at gmail.com uh, to say yo, say hello. Uh, I will provide for you a free 30 minute session. Again, I don't care where you live, we can do that virtually or in person. So, first person that does send me a quick yo note via the old email, I would love to engage with you. If there are no questions, there are no questions, I will turn off this live. I am grateful for each of you. Thank you for taking the time. If you found value in this workout, it would mean the world, mean the world to me if you just throw that thumb, maybe throw a comment, perhaps share it. And if you want more of this, by all means, subscribe to the channel. We're only going to keep getting stronger and turning back that chronological age. All right, friends, love you. Great work. Stay strong. Don't throw in the towel. Until next time.